Hi everyone, my name is Michael Sherry and I'm doing this video on behalf of Paul Sherry RVs. Today I'm showing a brand new 2020. This is a latter part of 2020, so this is what the 2021s are gonna look like just here in a, a month or two when they come out. Benefit of buying a late model 2020 over a brand new 2021 uh, that's coming out is you're gonna save a significant amount of money uh, just due to model year change. So, and you still get all the same cool stuff. This is a 2020 Forest River Alpha Wolf 26RB. This is a brand new floor plan for the Alpha Wolf line. The Alpha Wolf line is part of the Cherokee brand of products, which is the top producing and top selling manufacturer of travel trailers in the United States. And the reason they do that, they just pack a lot of stuff for the money that you spend. Uh, and the Alpha Wolf line is no different. The Alpha Wolf line is going to be an aluminum built travel trailer. So it's light weight and easy to tow. This particular one is really attractive to customers who have half ton pickup trucks and some SUVs as it weighs under 6,100 pounds. Yeah, under 6,100 pounds uh, with a super slide and a lot to offer. So let's get started in it. Comes with a solid uh, three quarter fiberglass front cap. It has these two really nice LED uh, docking lights. Those are going to light up your hitch area. So if you go to your campground, uh, maybe get there after dark, uh, you'll be able to unhitch with some light, which is nice. Or maybe you're a super early bird and want to get out on the road before anyone else does and the sun comes up. So you can turn those lights on to help you hitch up in the morning. It does have the bottom quarter of the front as a, as a rock guard there. So that's going to be a nice to protect the front end of your travel trailer two propane bottles here and we do prep it with a brand new battery uh, one thing that's really unique here about Paul Sherry RVs compared to the industry is we do not charge for prep and matter of fact we don't have any of those hidden fees that your local and your national dealers are charging that's one reason why customers are traveling hundreds of miles customer in right now all the way uh, five hours four hours away uh, from Cleveland Ohio uh, purchasing a brand new toy hauler so customers are coming from all over to do business here uh, and that's just one reason all right I love this outside storage compartment on this it's a pass-through storage and what I like it's at a nice height so you're not lifting up or dropping down into something it's pretty much at waist height and it's got a big door bigger than what I'm used to seeing and also this entire compartment's finished out notice the ceiling both walls and the floor is all finished out. It does come with this really nice light there. It's gonna help light this entire compartment up. Typically, I just see a light on one end to the other. So it's now really nice to have a light just on uh, all the way across to help light up this entire compartment. And then the ground here is going to be your linoleum, as you can see. So it's gonna be easy to clean and easy to keep clean. Super slide, that's gonna be a three foot deep slide. So that opens up the inside three more foot uh, which is really going to give you a lot of move around space this one's, we'll see that once we get inside rear of the trailer this one is equipped with the travel rack on the back uh, that travel rack also houses your spare tire and you can check out our website there but that travel rack is going to fold down right and you can put a lot of different things on it customers are putting their bicycles on it i've seen customers put portable generators on it and also totes uh, you know i imagine that they're might be firewood in those totes, which you're not allowed to do, uh, but you could put totes of something back there uh, to haul around, which is nice. This does have a power awning, which I can have out just part way. It's an adjustable power awning with a built-in LED light strip. All right, this is one reason uh, I didn't mention, but I think this is, in my opinion, the perfect couple's travel trailer. Now, it can sleep up to six, but if you're, you know, two people and want to camp and travel a lot this is ideal because it's going to tow really easy it has this awesome outside kitchen uh this refrigerator is the biggest refrigerator i've seen in an outside kitchen so that's the freezer portion over there sorry that the packing's coming loose and then this is the refrigerator portion on that side so it's double the size and you get a big freezer out here a little bit of storage up here in the cabinet all these lights are everywhere they're all led pancake lights i call them and then there is a sink here with hot and cold water and a drain which is important uh and there's uh, that switch there, turn on some indirect LED lighting. And then the, the workstation here is all in metal, which is nice. I've seen a lot of companies use wood in the past, and that wood tends to get wet because you leave this door open, you know, when it's raining, unfortunately. And uh, it's going to get a little wet, so it's nice having a water-resistant uh, type material that this base is built out of. 
go inside in just a second here but i do want to show you it comes with a factory television mount on the outside and also two exterior speakers this is going to play off the radio inside which i'll show you here in a second uh some attractive wheels on this it doesn't have just steel wheels they are alloy wheels as you can see and then uh, it has the nice uh, more ride entry step there and again, this is the 26RB Alpha Wolf, weighs 6,052 pounds. All right, let's take a look inside. So coming inside, it has a center living room and kitchen, and the slide room here it has the big U dinette and the couch. And then over here, we have our entertainment system. You're gonna have storage above, spot for a television pre-mounted right on the wall and audio video cords that are coming from your radio that's going to be bluetooth hdmi usb am fm aux port a lot of options there on how to listen to different uh, types of audio and then this down here is your space heater and doubles as a fireplace now I bypassed this as we walked in the doors. I wanted to show you this. This actually has a built-in pantry, but it's more than just a pantry. It's actually an oversized pantry. So you have your pantry shelves, right? A lot of shelves, a lot of storage. And then look at all the floor space. You could easily put a vacuum in here. Uh, and then it has a couple spots to hang some coats or maybe beach towels. Okay, kitchen areas all new redesign for this year so all new wood color which i i really like it's more of a modern type of wood color a lot of lighting notice all the pancakes lights so you can see in the kitchen which is important uh, new countertops uh, has this seamless countertop notice there's no seam on the edges here and that allows them to do this sunk down in kitchen sink so you can see it's sunk down underneath the countertop and it's a black stainless kitchen sink which is really attractive if you have not seen that yet the black stainless i definitely want to check out the black stainless and notice the sink cover that's just going to extend your usable countertop space it has the new oven which is a lp oven and notice the tile backsplash behind it that's going to allow it to be really easy to clean up glass door in the oven itself so you can see what you're baking or in my case, what you're burning. And then this is new for the later part of 2020s. This is the Furion 10 cubic foot uh, freezer up top, refrigerator down bottom. So that's gonna be about three to four cubic foot bigger than what we've typically seen in this size of trailer. All right, we have a really cool barn style door up here. There's actually two of them. This one leads into the bedroom. And the bedroom's gonna feature uh, closets on both sides of the bed, storage above, and a queen bed up here. Now what I like about how they do it in here, it's a private bedroom with that door, and you have these two nightstands on both sides of the bed with both USB power and normal power. And then here's where you hang your clothes, right in this cabinet here. And by putting that mirror in that cabinet, this makes for a good spot to get ready in the morning. And there's plenty of room to do it. There's a lot of floor space, both on the foot of the bed and beside both sides of the bed. Good windows, there's actually two windows in the bedroom. And then another spot to hang various maybe coats or towels, which I like. It's actually three total spots in this trailer. And then back towards the rear of the trailer, we have another barn door. I have it open. This is the bathroom. This is a really attractive part of this bathroom. It's more of a modern bathroom where it's kind of split up. So you have your medicine cabinet with storage behind there, all built in. Big sink, it has a really large sink uh, compared to what I'm used to seeing in uh, RVs in general. And then your stool is right here. And then almost in like an entire another section of the bathroom is this really big stand-up shower. So it has the skylight in there. Uh, give you an idea, I'm six foot tall. I can fit in here no problem with extra room above my head. Um, so that's a nice feature to have. And then across from there, again, more uh, places to hang your towels up. And then notice the blue LED lighting. And then big storage up here for your extra linens and things of that sort. Uh, also in the bathroom, uh, this is Cherokee exclusive. It puts the big fan in all their units, which I really like. It's just gonna help get any smells or steam out of this bathroom.